ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the DFS Experience for Tuesday, January 10th. We have a sl- seven-game slate. We're starting with DraftKings, starting with Luka Magic, 12.6K. If he's in against the Clippers, he owns the Clippers. You can fire him up, find value and play him. Steph Curry, if Steph is in, um, 10.6K. Make sure he's not under a minutes limit. Um, It's a shoulder injury, so he'll probably get his full run, but... Just pay attention to Curry News if he does play, and if he's in play, find value and play him. Harden, 10.4K. He looks better if Embiid is out. If Embiid is in, he's an okay play, but keep in mind, Maxi is back also. So right off top, um, Harden ha- Harden doesn't excite me, but depending on the Embiid news, um, Harden might come into play a little bit more, but obviously he's in the, the player pool. SGA, match approved, 10.3K, always in play against Miami. LaMelo Ball, 10, 10K, absolutely in play. Donovan Mitchell, 9.6K. I like Donovan Mitchell. I like the matchup. Looking for a close game with Utah. This Cleveland and Utah game stands out to me, and I think it's going to be a close game down to the wire, and I like a lot of pieces from this team, from this game. So Donovan Mitchell stands out a little bit to me, and, yes, I do know that um Garland is playing, so. Even with Garland playing next to him, I still like Mitchell. Dame Dollar, 9,500 against Orlando. Absolutely in play. Jordan Poole, 8,500 if Curry is in. Uh, he doesn't look as exciting, but if Curry is out another game, then Poole is fine. Hero, okay play, 8,400 if he's out. The other starters get a little bit of a bump. Van Vliet, 8,300, fine play. Garland, 7,700. He looks good also. I don't even mind playing both him and Mitchell together. That's just how I feel about this 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 game environment. Clarkson seventy three hundred and play. I like that game. Maxi seventy two hundred. A lot of things, you know, a lot of things gotta happen in Philly for me to like Maxi. I need MB to be out. Um, if Embiid is out, then I like Maxi a little bit. If Embiid is in. You can't play both Harden and Maxi, so um, they're just not enticing for me, to be honest with you. So I need Embiid to be out for me to play one of Harden or Maxi, to be honest. And I'm still not really interested either way. Um, Giddy seventy one hundred. He's an okay play. He's a good play against Miami. Dinwiddie seventy one hundred. If Luke is in. Dinwiddie is useless. If Luka is out, Dinwiddie is useful. Rosier sixty nine hundred okay play at sixteen at he's an okay play at his price his price point. Anthony Simon sixty five hundred. That's a fine play against Orlando. Marquez Fultz against Portland good price sixty one hundred. Defrancesco if he starts he's okay if he doesn't actually Wiggins is back. You don't really need Defrancesco at that price. Conley, 5,800. If that's your last man, then fine. No problem. Killing Hayes is in play, 5,700. De'Anthony Melton, 5,400. I don't really need Oladipo. If Hero is out, you could give Oladipo a little bit of a bump. But if he's coming off the bench, 5,300. If you're playing a lot of lineups, you could take a shot. Jalen Suggs, 5,300. Not interested. Jaden Ivey, 5,200. In play. Cole Anthony, you could take a shot. Alec Burks in play, 4,900. Not interested in John Wall. If Dwayne Washington was was to start for some reason, I'd absolutely be in play. Um, let's check Phoenix out real quick. They have one point guard available. Shamit is injured. Um, might have to go to Miles Bridges. Tory Craig is questionable. What they might do. To be honest with you, it just let the starters sit. Everyone except Mikael Bridges. Aiden, Craig, who's now a starter. They might just have Mikael Bridges play by himself with, with the rest of the scrubs. But they do need eight guys. They need nine guys, I think, to suit up. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, and then maybe they just have Craig suit up. So Dwayne Washington's in play. All right, so we got Dwayne Washington as value. He's going to be very popular, but 4.2K starting point guard 
is not bad. Reggie Jackson, if he comes off the bench again, I'm not interested. Terrence Mann, they might start him at uh, 4K, so he's in play also, but it's the Clippers, so, you know, take a shot if you like. Um, I think we need to go to shooting guard. Donovan, 9,600, like I said, um, I'm absolutely... Uh, I'm absolutely playing him in one of my first few lineups. I just like that game. Um, Clay Thompson, 7,900. He's not as interesting if Kyrie is back. OG, 64, always in play. Gary Trent, 61, always in play. Levert, not interested in. Um, Norman Powell, not interested in. If he started, I'm playing a lot of lineups. I could take a shot, but I'm not really interested in Clippers. Willie Beasley, 4,900 in play. Struess, you could take a shot on him if Hero doesn't play. Damian Lee, 3,400. You could take a shot. He's probably going to start. Most likely he will. Let's go to small forward. Markinen, 9700 Price is getting up there. I absolutely love Markinen. Um, also, in this game environment, 9700 is a little tough. Um, you know what? He's in play. He is in play. I was thinking in my head if I could get to him in one of my main lineups, and I absolutely could with one of those um, cheap guards that we're going we're gonna to have his value. So Markinen is absolutely fine. Um, Kawhi Leonard, 8,700. I'm not really interested, but he's in play. Bancaro, 8,200. I prefer he's in play. Wiggins, I don't really need. Wiggins played 19 minutes in his last game, so we're going to have to pay attention to Wiggins, um, on information about Wiggins' minutes, but, you know, with Clay and Poole and potentially Kyrie coming back, I'm not interested in Wiggins right now. Tobias is in play. I prefer Embiid to be out. If Embiid is in, I don't really need Tobias, to be honest. Wagner's in play. Scotty Barnes is in play. Josh Hart is in play. Miguel, Mikhail Bridges is in play. Hardaway, if Luke is in, I don't need Hardaway. If Luke is out, you can take a shot on Hardaway. Um, Gordon Hayward, no thank you. Jalen McDaniels, I don't need. Jalen Williams, I don't need right now. He'll definitely be in the player pool, but I don't see me getting to him right now. Um, Sadiq Bay, 4,600, absolutely in place. Should start. Just start for Bogdanovich. Um, he, he was starting already, so um, that shouldn't be an issue. But, yeah, he should get he should get a soak up a lot of Bogdanovich. Usage, he should get a lot of his shots. So, Sadiq Bay is absolutely in play. Actually, let's see who's starting. Because Duran is out also. So, you got Hayes, you got Ivy. You got Hayes, you got Ivy. Then you're going to have Sadiq Bay. You're going to have Isaiah Stewart at center. And then maybe they start Alec Burke. So, um, pay attention to Alec Burks also if he starts. But either way, he should be a good play. All right, where are we? Um, Scotty Barnes, Draymond. Wait, hold on. Hold on a second. All right, yeah, Sadiq Bay. So we got Sadiq Bay. Gary Harris, not really interested in. Reggie Bullock, definitely not interested in. Um, we already got some value pieces. All right, so let's go to power forward. Jimmy Butler, 8,900 against OKC in play. Christian Wood, 8,600. Um, he's in play. A little priced up on a seven-game slate, but what are you going to do? Um, he's in play. Uh, Jeremy Grant, 7,400 against Orlando in play. Draymond Green, 6,500. Not interested at all. P.J. Washington, 5,600. I'll absolutely take a shot. Vanderbilt, no Kelly Olenek, 5,500. I'll take a shot. 
my Wagner, I don't feel like I need. Isaiah Stewart, starting 5100, absolutely in play. Kevin Love, I don't need. Um... All right, I don't see anyone else at power forward I'm taking a shot on. Um, is Schwain right? Let's see, 23 minutes, 20 fantasy points, 16 minutes, 17 fantasy points, 12 minutes, 9 fantasy points. I mean, he's going to get some run. There's going to be a lot of cheap guys on Phoenix, so just pay attention to the value from Phoenix. Um... I don't need anybody else from down here right now. So let's just go to setting. And beat 11 2 if he's in, good for him. If he's out, um, Harden, Maxi, Tobias. Siakam looks good against Charlotte, 10.1K. I love Siakam on the slate. Bam against OKC, 9,100. He looks good on the slate also. Aiden, if he plays 7,500, he looks good. Um... Carter, Wendell Carter, 6,400 in play. Jared Allen, 6,200. He looks great against Utah, absolutely in play. Nurkic, 6,100 against Orlando in play. Plumlee in play, 6K. Looney, I don't need Looney with um the Warriors getting healthy, so I'll stay away from Looney. Not like he's a bad play, but I'm going to stay away. Zubak, I can't trust his minutes right now. i love to play him at 5,200. If I was playing like 10, 12 lineups, I'll probably take a shot on one and hope for the best. But in my single entry, I can't do it to myself because I don't know if he's going to play 35 minutes or 20 minutes. So unfortunately, um, Zubat Zuba can't be one of my main lineups. Can't be one of my main lineups. Um, If there's no Embiid, Harrell should start 4,800. You could take a shot on him. And if Harrell starts, then Reed would back him up at 3,900. And you can absolutely take a shot on him. If Nurkic is out, you can take a shot on Eubanks. And if Aiton is out, you can take a shot on Landale. Landale and Bayambo. That's if you need all that extra value. But you'll have more value by the time Locke comes around. So... All right, so we got to center. Let's get five guys and let's get going. Uh, I'm feeling, I'm feeling like a Donovan Mitchell get a Donovan Mitchell day against Utah. I'm picking up Mitchell. I'm gonna pick up doing Washington as value, so I can get a lot of the Utah pieces, Utah Cleveland pieces. Doing Washington, forty two hundred. Then we're gonna go. I'm going. Um. Yeah, I'm gonna pick up marketing. Pick up marketing. Power forward. Um. Power forward. Let's pick up Walker Kessler. He should start. He should start in place of. He should start in place of Olenek, and he's already too cheap. So we could literally pay for anyone that we want. Um, I got Donovan Mitchell. I got Markkinen. We could pick up Clarkson. We could pick up. All right, two. You, let's pick up somebody from Cleveland to balance it out. Let's see if we could get Garland. Let's see what it looks like with Garland. Seventy-seven at guard. Forty-seven hundred. That's fine. So I'm gonna go with Dwayne Washington as value for the for the injured Phoenix Sun. So that's forty two hundred. Then we got Donovan Mitchell at ninety six in the great matchup against Utah. Same game, bringing it back with Markinen at ninety seven hundred. A little bit tougher matchup for him, but he's the go to guy. Then you got Walker Kessler forty seven hundred starting at center. The same game for Utah. And then you're bringing that back with um. Darius Garland at 7700 in the same game. And you're going to have tons of value um, if you want to play the same lineup. So that's five guys that I like from DraftKings. If you're new here, welcome. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe. Hit the bell. Thumbs up. Absolutely helps me. It helps, 
helps the channel grow. Um, if you're interested in my spe specific up to the up to the up to the minute optimal lineup sent to you before lock, I can do that for you. Check out the Patreon linked in the description, and we could jump to Fanduel where I already found five guys that I like, and let's see who they are and let's get lost. All right, so Fanduel. Walker Castle is 5,500 at center. I'm fine with that. I like Siakam in the slate against Charlotte. You know he's going to destroy Charlotte by himself. So we got a little bit of an underpriced Siakam, 9,500. We got Markinen, 8,200 against Cleveland that you already know that I like. We got Jordan Clarkson, same game, 6,800. And then I got Donovan Mitchell again at 8,900. A little bit too cheap for... Um, his ceiling against Utah. So, like I said, this Cleveland-Utah game, I'm looking for a close game down to the wire where the stars shine. And if, if everything breaks the way I think that it will break, then I'll cash. And that's what DF, DFS is, right? Predicting, predicting outcomes. But listen, I'm going to go on and get out of here. Let you get back to doing whatever it is you guys are doing. Hope you had a profitable night. And I'm going to catch you guys in the next one. Ciao.